A ticker symbol or stock symbol is an abbreviation used to uniquely identify publicly traded shares of a particular stock on a particular stock market. A stock symbol may consist of letters, numbers or a combination of both. Ticker symbol refers to the symbols that were printed on the ticker tape of a ticker tape machine. Interpreting the symbol Stock symbols are unique identifiers assigned to each security traded on a particular market. A stock symbol can consist of letters, numbers, or a combination of both, and is a way to uniquely identify that stock. The symbols were kept as short as possible to reduce the number of characters that had to be printed on the ticker tape, and to make it easy to recognize by traders and investors. The allocation of symbols and formatting convention is specific to each stock exchange. In the U.S., for example, stock tickers are typically between one and four letters and represent the company name where possible. For example, U.S.-based computer company stock Apple Inc. traded on the NASDAQ exchange has the symbol AAPL, while the motor company Ford stock that is traded on the New York Stock Exchange has the single letter ticker F in Europe. Most exchanges use three letter codes, for example, Dutch consumer goods company Unilever traded on the Amsterdam Euronext exchange has the symbol UNA. While in Asia, numbers are often used as stock tickers to avoid issues for international investors when using non-Latin scripts. For example, the bank HSBC's stock traded on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange has the ticker symbol 0005. Symbols sometimes change to reflect mergers. Prior to the 1999 merger with Mobile Oil, Exxon used a phonetic spelling of the company. XON as its ticker symbol the symbol of the firm after the merger was XOM symbols are sometimes reused in the US the single letter symbols are particularly sought after as vanity symbols for example since march 2008 visa inc has used the symbol v that had previously been used by vivendi which had delisted and given up the symbol to fully qualify a stock both the ticker and the exchange or country of listing needs to be known. On many systems both must be specified to uniquely identify the security. This is often done by appending the location or exchange code to the ticker. Other identifiers Although stock tickers identify a security, they are exchange-dependent, generally limited to stocks and can change. These limitations have led to the development of other codes in financial markets to identify securities for settlement purposes. The most prevalent of these is the International Securities Identifying Number an ISIN uniquely identifies a security and its structure is defined in ISO 6166. Securities for which ISINs are issued include bonds, commercial paper, stocks, and warrants. The ISIN code is a 12-character alpha-numerical code that does not contain information characterizing financial instruments, but serves for uniform identification of a security at trading and settlement. The ISIN identifies the security, not the exchange if any, on which it trades, it is therefore not a replacement for the ticker symbol. For instance, Daimler AG stock trades on 22 different stock exchanges worldwide, and is priced in five different currencies, it has the same ISIN on each -E though not the same ticker symbol. ISIN cannot specify a particular trade in this case, and another identifier, typically the three or four letter exchange code such as the market identifier code will have to be specified in addition to the ISIN. <laughs> Symbol for stock market indices 
While usually a stock ticker identifies a security that can be traded, stock market indices are also sometimes assigned a symbol, even though they can generally not be traded. Symbols for indices are usually distinguished by adding a symbol in front of the name, such as a caret or a dot. For example, Reuters lists the NASDAQ Composite Index under the symbol, IXIC. Symbols by country Canada In Canada the Toronto Stock Exchange TSX and the TSXV use the following special codes after the ticker symbol. United Kingdom In the United Kingdom, prior to 1996, stock codes were known as EPICs, named after the London Stock Exchange's Exchange Price Information Computer e.g. MKS for Marks and Spencer. Following the introduction of the sequence trading platform in 1996, EPICs were renamed Tradable Instrument Display Mnemonics (TIDM), but they are still widely referred to as EPICs. Stocks can also be identified using their settle stock exchange daily official list number or their ISIN international securities identification number. Topic <inaudible> United States in the United States, modern letter only ticker symbols were developed by Standard and Poor's S&P to bring a national standard to investing. Previously, a single company could have many different ticker symbols as they varied between the dozens of individual stock markets. The term ticker refers to the noise made by the ticker tape machines once widely used by stock exchanges. The S&P system was later standardized by the securities industry and modified as years passed. Stock symbols for preferred stock have not been standardized. Some companies use a well known product as their ticker symbol. Belgian brewer InBev, the brewer of Budweiser beer, uses Bud as its three letter ticker for American depository receipts, symbolizing its premier product in the United States. Its rival, Molson Coors Brewing Company, uses a similarly beer related symbol, TAP. Likewise, Southwest Airlines pays tribute to its headquarters at Love Field in Dallas through its «Love» symbol. Cedar Fair Entertainment Company, which operates large amusement parks in the United States, uses «Fun» as its symbol. Harley-Davidson uses «Hog» for its Harley Owners Group. Yamana Gold uses «Auy», because on the periodic table of elements, «O» is the symbol for gold. Sotheby's, the famous auction house, uses the symbol bid. While most symbols come from the company's name, sometimes it happens the other way around. Tricon Global, owner of KFC, Pizza Hut and Taco Bell, adopted the symbol yum to represent its corporate mission when the company was spun out of PepsiCo in 1997. In 2002, the company changed its name to match its symbol, adopting the name Yum. Brands, symbols sometimes change to reflect mergers. Prior to the 1999 merger with Mobile Oil, Exxon used a phonetic spelling of the company Xon as its ticker symbol. The symbol of the firm after the merger was Xom. After Hewlett Packard merged with Compaq, the new firm took on the ticker symbol HPQ. The former symbols were HWP and CPQ. AT&T's ticker symbol is simply T. Accordingly, the company is referred to simply as Telephone on Wall Street. The T symbol is so well known that when the company was purchased by SBC, it took the AT&T name, capitalizing on its history and keeping the desired single letter symbol. 
Some examples of U.S. stock symbols include, A, Agilent Technologies AAPL, Apple Inc. BRK, O, Berkshire Hathaway Class A shares C, Citigroup Goog, Alphabet Inc. Hogg, Harley-Davidson Inc. HPQ, Hewlett-Packard INTC, Intel Co., The Coca-Cola Company Love, Southwest Airlines after their main hub at Love Field M, Minnesota Mining and Manufacturing 3M MSFT, Microsoft T, AT&T TGT, Target Corporation TXN, Texas Instruments WMT, Walmart formerly, a glance at a U.S. stock symbol and its appended codes would allow an investor to determine where a stock trades. However, in July 2007, the SEC approved a rule change allowing companies moving from the New York Stock Exchange to the NASDAQ to retain their three letter symbols. DirecTV was one of the first companies to make this move. When first implemented, the rule change did not apply to companies with one or two letter symbols, but subsequently any stock was able to move from the NYSE to the NASDAQ without changing its symbol. CA, Inc., which trades under the symbol CA, moved from the NYSE to the NASDAQ in April 2008 and kept its two letter symbol. Topic single letter ticker symbols A, Agilent Technologies formerly Astra AB, B, Barnes Group C, Citigroup previously used for Chrysler, D, Dominion Resources E, ENI Spa F, Ford Motor Company G, Genpact previously GE its H, Hyatt formerly Realogy Corporation I, Intelsat Global Holdings SA previously First Interstate Bancorp K, Kellogg L, Lowe's Corporation Formerly Liberty Media M, Macy's Inc. Formerly M Corp O, Realty Income Corporation P, Pandora Media Inc. Previously Philips Petroleum Company Q, Quintiles Previously Quest R, Rider System Inc. S, Sprint Corporation Previously Sears, Roebuck and Company T, AT and TV, Visa Inc. Previously Vivendi W, Wayfair Previously Westvaco X, US Steel Y, Allegheny Corporation Z, Zillow Previously Woolworth, now known as Foot Locker, which changed its ticker to FL in 2001 Unassigned letters J. Open, previously Jackpot Enterprises N. Open, formerly Inco, then NetSuite U. Open, previously U.S. Airways Other countries In countries where Arabic script is used, and in East Asia, transliterated Latin script versions of company names may be confusing to an unpracticed Western reader. Stock symbols provide a simple means of clear communication in the workplace. Many Asian countries use numerical or alphanumerical ticker symbols instead of characters to facilitate international trade. Industrial and Commercial Bank of China 01398 Hong Kong HSBC 00005 Hong Kong DBS Bank D05 Singapore Jardine C&C C07 Singapore Tonen General Sekiu KK5012 Japan Toshiba Corp 6502 Japan China Citic Bank Corp Limited 601998 Shanghai China Hubei Golden Ring Co Limited 000615 Shenzhen China Asistec 2357 Taiwan Chenghua Telecom Co Limited 2412 Taiwan Topic See also CUSIP Market identification code Option symbol Settle Word paper can number